Okay, so today uh, I'm at Oli Airy in Bruton. Uh, it's the uh, uh, exhibition finishes tomorrow, so I thought I'd better pop up and have a look. It's in a, an old chapel, which is great, but it's a permanent space. I've just had a walk around and had a chat to the director. Really, really interesting work, really great artists. So if you are in Bruton um, tomorrow, Saturday the 2nd of March, I recommend it. Now oh, look at this space. Absolutely brilliant. Really nicely presented as well. Moscow, Alexis Sol Grey. This is Samuel Bassett, Fields at Dawn. Little piece. And then this is Kim Brooker, Complicated Muse. I like that. Looks like an unprimed canvas. Acrylic and charcoal on canvas. Yeah. yeah, she had a big exhibition recently. stuff and then who is this this is um, Difficulty finding it. I'll get back to that. Look at these again. So yeah, these are Alexis Soul Grey. And that big one was Tomo Campbell. And these are Laura Ford, Dancing Clog Girls. Really interesting work. Got a couple of Claire Woods. The smell of Sunday. Oil on aluminium. And tread lightly. Again, oil on aluminium.
the law of fraud, red mist. Really interesting work. <laughs> Look at this context. And then here we've got another Samuel Bassett through the cliffs and into the sea. Interesting. So you can see the landscape elements, but also these figurative elements and text as well. I think he lives in Cornwall. And then another Alexis Soul Grey. Try to listen to what I tell you. <laughs> Hello. So, on top of the stairs, we've got another little Samuel Bassett. Man upstairs. Then we've got um, what else we got here? So this is by. Laura Ford. So we've got three of her pieces in here. It's a really sweet little piece. Wool inhabiting creature, blue. <laughs> and over here we've got, what is this one called? Um, rocks in my pocket, devil on my back. Alexis Soul Grey. Some little collages. This is a collage embroidery transfer on found paper. So, yours, collage, scratches on found paper. Then the other end of the room, we've got another Samuel Bassett. Buildings on a sandy shore. Looks like he's actually written the word sandy there. I can't actually see any buildings, but... 
It's a good thing about painting, isn't it? You don't have to actually paint any buildings, but you can say you have in the description. And then this is Catherine Maple, who I believe has got a big exhibition coming up at Bowley and Workman uh, next week, I think. So it's, it's throughout March. And this one's pastel on paper. And I think she's going to have, have, going to have pastel on canvas. So I'm looking forward to seeing this exhibition. Oh yeah, of course this little one in the corner here, which is really sweet. Well, it's, I'm not sure if sweet's the right word, but um, quite a visceral piece. And right, where's the name of this one? Tempest, that's it. Tiny piece, about eight inches high. That's all right. I just finished by looking down into the gallery from up here. Quite sure what that says. Yeah, what a great space, eh? Really good to see really interesting contemporary work in Bruton in Somerset. So yeah, like I say, this exhibition finishes tomorrow the second of March. And then the next one opens um, next week, I believe. So, yeah. Great. Hope you enjoyed that.